But we have breaking news coming in at the moment, coming in from Maharashtra. Massive fire in uh, Sambhaji Nagar of Aurangabad. Uh, this is a fire that broke out at about 4 o'clock in the morning. Has resulted in seven people dying. This includes two men, three women and uh, two children. A probe is underway. We have my colleague Radhika joining us on the phone line. Radhika, even though the flames didn't reach the victims, they've apparently died of suffocation. That's right, a massive fire breaking out in a clothing shop in a tailoring unit in Sambhaji Nagar, resulting in seven deaths due to suffocation. In fact, uh, three women, two men and two children are among those uh, who died in the tragic incident. The cause of the blaze is still unknown. In fact, as per the police officials there, the incident uh, took place at around 4 a.m. in the shop located in cantonment area there. In fact, a tailoring shop and several establishments were located on the ground floor of the building. Uh, while people were living on the upper floor, it is suspected that the people uh, who, in fact, uh, died were sleeping on the ground floor uh, on that uh, tragic uh, night. In fact, the shop suddenly caught fire at around 4 a.m. In fact, the police uh, and the fire brigade uh, were informed about the incident at about 4.15, after which, of course, uh, the fire brigade officials rushed to the spot. A smoke entering the first floor where the family was residing. In fact, uh, uh, seven casualties unfortunately have occurred at due to suffocation. And the disease, as I mentioned, includes three women, two men, and two children. Cause of the fire is uh, still unknown, uh, but uh, the incident has been reported. The fire brigade officials are still at the spot. Uh, uh, at this point, uh, uh, and uh, inquiry is still on to ascertain the exact cause that led to the fire. Right. Uh, thank you so much, Radhika, for getting us details of uh, breaking news coming in of seven people who have apparently died of smoke inhalation in Aurangabad after that fire that broke out at about four o'clock in the morning.